Now, Korea's very first original musical, The Last Empress, marks its 20th anniversary this year. After gaining international fame, it has come back to local theatres with a new look and storyline for its legion of fans here in Korea. Kim ji reports. It's not difficult to be enticed by the refined court silhouette of The Last Empress, let alone its captivating plot. The musical is based on the life of Empress Myeongsong and her death by Japanese assassins in the late 19th century. Kim Soyeon, who plays a leading role of Empress Myeongsong, says she couldn't help but cry while portraying such a historical figure. Sometimes I couldn't carry on during the songs about her son and internal struggles. It brought tears to my eyes. The Last Empress is regarded by local critics as something of a milestone. It's considered as the country's first blockbuster musical, mainly attributed to its international recognition and success. The Last Empress was the first Korean musical ever to be performed at the Lincoln Center's New York State Theater in 1997. The musical was so popular, it returned to the New York staple venue in summer the following year. It was something of a miracle. We weren't able to pay the performers at the time due to budget restraints, but they followed along with national pride in mind. To keep up with the changing times, the latest version added songs and a subplot about a security guard in charge of protecting the empress. This musical success shows that original productions and their adaptations can be well made while appealing to the general public. The Last Empress is played at Seoul Arts Center's Opera Theater through September 10th. Kim Jeong, Arirang News.